Jeep Cherokee snorkel. <clears throat> this is the what I call the eBay Amazon Chinese special. <clears throat> oh, this is excellent quality. You get down to mounting it up. They want to use this big cheesy flex tube. And my tire would rip it off the first time I went off road. <clears throat> they give you a little adapter that goes on an air box. You got to drill through here, drop it down. So I went with a three inch to two inch rubber coupling, two inch plumbing. All the way up under the fender. Another three to two inch rubber coupling. <clears throat> I bet you I got less than a hundred bucks for all the pieces and silicone to seal the piece on your air box. <clears throat> Works excellent. Drove through some rain yesterday. People seal their airbox totally, which I don't understand that part because that scoop's going to suck water in. Eventually, water's going to build up <clears throat> in your airbox and it's going to suck into your motor. Your airbox has factory uh, pretty much drip holes or drain holes that are very, very small. So if you're crossing a river or stream, and you're just crossing it, you'll be okay. I wouldn't park in water. <clears throat> I wouldn't just drive around up to the hood in water because your computer's on the fender, your coil, your alternator, everything else is not waterproof. <clears throat> but it rams cold air down in. I picked up at least one mile per gallon. And I got a cannon. Uh, high flow air filter coming that will help more but I've seen people say they <clears throat> lose power this and that no ain't nothing from the snorkel unless you just straight up cut the airflow off to your motor but two inch plenty airflow runs down the highway everything just fine easily road's busy today finally stopped raining so I figured I'd shoot this little video <clears throat> snorkels well worth it <clears throat>